Hey, Sagittarius. Let's see what messages come out for y'all today. Might hear the, they cut in the grass, so. Might hear the alarm, I mean, not the alarm. The damn lawnmower. Poise just popped out. My Holy Spirit, ancestors of the highest white light. Allow me to channel the energy of my Sagittarius, please and thank you. Archangel Michael, please protect me as I channel this energy. Spirit, what's going on for Sagittarius? Please and thank you. Your first card is poise. There, there's been... Okay, so there was some type of collaboration going on. And uh, I feel like you need to take a pause from that. You need to take a pause from that collaboration. It has something to do with a court, with that pillar right there. But you need to take a pause from that collaboration so that you can... There's something with missing time. See, how I talked about this yesterday. How that's cut out of that clock. There could be something here with a child. With some time or something. Missing some time with something. Spirit, what's going on? Someone is even being exalted. Some of y'all are getting angelic help. You're getting help from spirit. Spirit speaks through you. I'm, it's almost like a... Okay, so you, I don't, you see spirit space right there in your chest? But you see how she's... It's almost like she is... Not in control of this, whatever this is. I mean, it could be a he too taking her raising it. I'm just going by the car. Mm. Anyway, it says poise, but I'm getting paused. It needs to be a, a somebody needs to take a break from whatever this collaboration is. Now, let's see, Spirit. What's going on? Y'all, these readings are for entertainment purposes only. Don't make anything fit. Don't put anyone above your own intuition. All right, you got flexible. So, I'm also getting, okay, so this flexible card, and I can break it down to a 10. Whatever this pause or this break in this collaboration, people may be upset that you don't want to do this anymore. And so, it could be causing some problems. People could be mad at you. You're just going to have to be flexible while something is ending. I don't know what this is. But anyway. You are still growing. You see the flower coming out the head? So you're still growing. And your hands are firmly firmly planted on whatever this is spirit. It's spirit's face right there. So you do have a good grip. On, maybe you have a good grip on your intuition or your faith, whatever spirit's going to be symbolic to them. But I'm just really getting, it needs to be a pause in this collaboration. Alright, spirit. What's going on? Tell me what's going on. What's going on? Flowers. I want to give you your flower. Mm -hmm. Somebody feel like you could look at someone as if they're a golden egg or someone could be viewing you that way, but somebody's doing too much. Whatever this collaboration is, I need mean, I mean, break. This could be your regular job, this could be friends, family, whatever you was working with, or whoever you was working with. Or it could have just been a regular, like a, maybe you just lost a job. And so you're having to be flexible while you go through this ending right here. And so in that case, spirit is working something out for you. Okay, so you have in between the worlds. Last night I had a dream. This man, he was in this a fucking portal. He's trying to pull it to the other side. And that's what it looked like. I don't even know who that man is. Anyway, bottom of the deck, new life. All right, spirit. Let's clarify this. See what's going on. What's going on? Tell me what's going on. What's going on? 
Some of y'all been going through some type of DNA upgrades. Alright, what's the message here? So, I wonder what this was. It's going to be different for everybody. This collaboration that needs to be a pause in it. And someone's being exalted as well. And Spirit is working something out for someone who's facing type of ending. When it came to, that's why I get work because I'm looking at the grass, how it's care, carefully, perfectly manicured, the flowers, how everything's growing. Um, so you could have been investing in something, working hard or something, and that could have came to an end, 19 breaking down to a 10. But that's because spirit is working something out for you. Six of Wands. This is recognitions, victory, and success. But just be mindful of those around you because not everybody's happy for you. With whatever this is, okay? And your intuition is telling you that. You see how the horse is looking bad? The horse would be symbolic to your intuition. Because I feel like your intuition leads you. It drives you just like, like this horse is driving you. It's your intuition, but it's looking bad at whoever this is. Maybe it's someone who has blonde hair or I'm just going off the car. But your intuition is letting you know, even though you are busy moving forward um, with some type of success, maybe you had a new idea or maybe you're just starting doing something on your own. This person, just be mindful of whoever that is. Okay. What else, Spirit? What else is going on? We have that, and we have the Seven of Cups with the Queen of Cups and the Tower. Shit. What's at the bottom? The Two of Wands. Whatever decision this is that you're making, maybe someone tried to confuse you with something with this Seven of Cups. But whatever decision this is that you're making, you're going to have to stand on it because I saw the Seven of Wands. You're going to have to defend it. Your decision to do whatever this is. And it could be to follow your intuition with this cup right here. Some of you, okay, somebody wants you to focus on all these other things with the seven of cups. And maybe you just want to focus on this. So, if you if you were working with some people, they want you to finish doing this work. And maybe you want to get into a relationship. Or you just want to focus on loving yourself. Whatever this cup going to be symbolic to, Okay. Judgment and then the hermit. So I feel like you're making the choice to go within. Maybe you don't want to be bothered with nobody. I feel like your time is you putting your time in other places. It, it's, it could be a masculine who wants you to do this. I don't know. Judgment with the hermit. Someone could be dealing with the Virgo. Also, somebody could want a second chance. This tower is some type of divine intervention. Because for some of you, I was getting, there was a collaboration that you didn't even know about. And maybe it was draining you or something. Okay? You have a king of swords here. What's this king of swords? King of swords is no match to a queen of cups. Yeah, this is somebody who has no compassion for you at all. King of cups in the reverse. So... Or they're playing mind games or something like that. It's, it's not healthy. And maybe that was the collaboration of King of Swords and the Queen of Cups. Okay. Yep, mind games. Five of Swords. Having to win by any means necessary. There could even be a little bit of envy or jealousy here. Maybe this was someone who's trying to keep you isolated. Wanted to keep people away from you. Um, yeah. They're taking, maybe they was pressing and taking your ideas or taking your say as their own, some shit like that. Not giving you credit for some. So for some of y'all, you're going to receive some type of credit for something that you did when it came to some type of collaboration. Because the first tarot card out was the Six of Wands. And it's, it's almost like you ain't got to do nothing with that boy spirit handling something for you. All right. What else, spirit? And we have the four of wands. So this could be surrounding your stability. Or this could be involving a home, 
relationship, a marriage. All right, you have the nine of swords. This mask, there's a masculine energy. They could be a little bit older or have white salt and pepper hair. They are stressed out. Why? This person is stressing because now they gotta take some type of action. They don't wanna take it. You see the hand right here? I don't even think that that's a word, but I've gotten it before begrudgingly. I don't think it's a word, but I feel like this person you know they gotta take action and do something that they don't wanna do. Because up until now, they've been playing mind games, King of Swords, and maybe that's been working. Maybe that was keeping you stuck in something. But there's some type of DNA upgrades happening for you. And uh, whatever this person was doing, and maybe it's just not working anymore. What else here? If this was someone who was trying to have you isolated and stuck on them, it could it could backfire to where they're obsessed with you or something like that because you're moving towards a new life energy over here so you're going to be collaborating with like-minded individuals this was not like-minded queen of cups king of swords mm -mm. if you've been for some of you maybe they did have feelings but they hit them with the king of cups in the reverse and chose to play mind games with this five of swords for others of you they just wanted to confuse you i knew there was some mind games going on okay so now you have a three of cups. I feel like this is your energy. You're ready to celebrate. Something could be happening around the fall time. With that pumpkin right there. So this could be coming up. You have a ten of swords. Ooh, child. With a queen of swords and an ace of pentacles. So, uh, someone could have betrayed you. Or, shit, you can try to. It could have been a couple fucking with somebody, too, with that three of cups right there. Or these could be co-workers. Six of Pentacles. Somebody could be getting a payout. But there's about to be some type of reciprocity right here. Yeah, Ace of Wands. Someone's having a brand new beginning. Here you go, Sagittarius. You have your temperance with the Queen of Wands. Yeah, somebody missed some type of opportunity because they tried to hold back, hold you back. For something, it's like a city was trying to hold someone back. Or maybe this person works for the city. Four of Cups, Four of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. But the Queen of Wands with this, uh, damn. The, the Queen of Wands is the match to the King of Wands, but somebody was doing too much. And they know it. Five of Cups. So, Five of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, and the Fool. If you were in this Five of Pentacles or in this Ten of Wands, you, you're walking away from that. That Fool card is this new life. And with this TikTok, like, I feel like it's getting ready to happen soon. Really, really soon. So, I just saw the Ace of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. It could be a new job, a new relationship. It's something new. And, damn, the Eight of Pentacles right there, too. Some of you are choosing to do something on your own. It could be something creative because they look like they're sitting on the bench creating Let's pull some of these spirit. Look, first light, beginning a new cycle. That's that, uh, excuse me, that fool with that new life. Okay. Maybe somebody even tried to play you for the fool. I can't make it up, entrepreneur. I said, some of y'all get ready to start y'all own shit. Self-employment suits your disposition and intentions. What I say you want to follow your intuition? This this card says working for yourself allows you to be better follow your intuition and divine guidance. We are your co-workers. We spirit. So whatever this collaboration was, for some of y'all it was like healing or it's some something to do with energy maybe, but that, you don't need to do that. Some of y'all need to step out and do something on your own. And express your divine feminine energy, embracing its magical intuition and nurturing qualities. Because some of y'all are going to be getting, you see how this angel's over this person's shoulder? You're going to be getting some type of trustworthy guidance. That's that Ace of Wands. And it says this, you've received a wonderful idea as an answer to your prayer. Because you could, the collaboration that you was in kept you in the Five of Pentacles, Ten of Wands. And Spirit said it's time for some reciprocity, Six of Pentacles. 
So there could be a new partner coming. Right? A chance meeting was no mistake. It was divinely orchestrated as a catalyst to set the wheels in motion. So pay careful attention to the new people we send in your life. You're going to recognize them by your sense of comfort and safety. Yeah, this king of swords, king of wands, could have been past life energy. It's, you know, maybe you had to heal from that. This person was also doing some spell work. You see that? Energy coming out of their hands. This masculine was doing some type of spell work. Possibly to keep you um, seven of cups hermit. Mm. So anyway, let's grab a life purpose. Yeah, you might need to shield yourself. But somebody could be in the music industry. Be willing to forgive and shield yourself from this person, these people. I did a reading yesterday. It was called The Rebel and the Authority. It was trying to control you. But I feel like you wanted to leave with your intuition. So maybe with this entrepreneurial card, because self I mean, you'll know. Like any job you get, it don't matter. If you're working for someone else, you're going to feel five of Pentacles, ten of I felt that my whole life. I always wonder why. I mean, I done had a million jobs. I always wonder why I just never quite fit in any of them jobs because I was never meant to work for nobody else. I'm not trying to sound better than no one or nothing like that. It's just like this card say, self-employment suits your disposition and intentions. Working for yourself allows you to better follow your intuition and divine guidance. Because when you got a lot of people around you with this three of cups, you have a lot of, uh, maybe this per one person wants you to go this way, another person wants you to do that. And maybe you're not meant for all of that. Maybe that's not in your, uh, what am I going to say, description. It's not in your life purpose right now. You're not in alignment with that. So whatever that was, that shit coming to an end. <coughs> and you will see, you're about to come out that five of pentacles ten of And so maybe some of you don't know what it is that you want to do yet. You're going to get some type of ideas that's what the cards say. And it's trustworthy. You really need to see from this life purpose day. Somebody was just trying to keep you bogged down, break from you, play mind games with you. They're gonna regret it. What if the five cups are already right now? You don't do that with no guys. Have you lost your motherfucking mind? Yeah, you gotta have listen, baby. Heart's desires. Cause you deserve it. The angels are supporting and guiding, protecting you as your dreams become a reality. The bottom of the deck is teaching. Some of you inspire young people to learn. Okay, that's what's up. Some of you may become a spiritual teacher. That would allow for you to use your intuition. You could heal with your classes, sessions, and seminars. So maybe somebody was trying to get someone in music or something that ain't got shit to do with what they was called to do. I don't know. Anyway, this uh, energy is about to be cleared out. And it's happening in a way that you... I feel like you ain't got nothing to do with it with that tower. There's some type of divine intervention. Okay? Let's get an affirmation. Where my affirmation did? Let's get an affirmation that we want to close this out. So some of you guys can deal with Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and Virgo. Another Sagittarius. Aries or Leo. Well, we got this King of Swords, this air sign. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. It don't matter. And with that past life, just don't deal with no motherfuckers coming back. People show up in your dreams, you got to, like, take control. See, some of y'all made a decision not to go back or not to, to work with these people. We got to stand on that. No matter, maybe, you know, maybe somebody was hoping that if they put you in, this is desperate. Mm. Y'all, my ears ringing. This is desperate energy, five of pentacles, ten of wands. But just keep moving forward. Because maybe somebody was hoping that if they could put you in a desperate position, that you would accept crumbs. No, just keep moving forward. Maybe they were trying to make it hard for you, you know, to do what you was called to do. But if you know that's what you was called to do, you just got to keep going. But some of y'all just has something to do with religion. With this five of pentacles. These people are outside the church. Alright. What's a good affirmation for this reading? 
Please and thank you. What is a good affirmation? <laughs> mm -hmm. I take care of all my needs to show up as my best self. You have to come out of this ten of wands, five of pentacles. Whatever you, whoever you was working with, because there was no reciprocity. Maybe they were just using me. Let me see. Some of y'all are anointed. And so when you are in that anointing, and you cannot just put, look at that angelic spirit speak through you while you sleep. That could be what I was picking up right here, spirit face right there. But I'm like, it look like this person ain't got no control over it. Maybe somebody's hypnotizing you and doing shit without your fucking permission. Because um, what was I watching earlier? There's something with a church. The, there's a van just rolled through. It says Alton Park Church of Christ. So definitely something here with church. And I had a dream the other night of that priest who was trying to do some fuckery to me. And I'm like, you're going to confess with your mouth what you're trying to do because it ain't right. But um, I was watching something earlier. And he's, he, he was saying that he could hypnotize people. He, he said, if I tell them to act like a chicken, they'll act like a chicken. Maybe somebody will hypnotize you to do some shit. Also, I was watching... Uh, where these, I think it was law enforcement, was using the fuck out of somebody. Like, I don't know what this is, but you, you're not going to be doing that no more. And with that divine intervention, for some of y'all, you won't even have no control. Spirit will cut your intuition. Okay, so if it was your intuition that they was using, spirit will cut it. There's some type of divine intervention right there. Okay, so there's something with Florida, Georgia, Tennessee, maybe somebody living in the South. Talk to your angels. I mean, you got very intuitive at the bottom of the deck. Protect your energy, child. Maybe they were just using your energy. I don't know. Yeah, something. What else, baby? A A A abundance and you got black market right here. What the fuck? That could be that ten of swords energy. I don't know. I wouldn't worry about it. Something new coming through. Okay, so you got a new partner, new life, and some new energy is surrounding work. The ace of wands. Now, let's close this out. Yeah. So, you can have people. Tesla. Can't nobody in this neighborhood for no damn Tesla. A situation that needed resolution will be resolved and healed. What I'm scared. The media. Step to the spotlight and get seen. Don't allow your talent to go unnoticed. I don't want to be in the media. But maybe some of y'all do. Maybe some of y'all have the opportunity. To have a career in television, radio, magazine, or any mass media job. But for some, you might need to get more publicity around the situation in order to increase your finances. Alright, so you have change. There's a, a there's a change for the better coming your way. And you have teacher, life purpose. And y'all know what that is. So, be mindful. Yes, my love get ready to change for the better. Because that five pentacles to the one, hell no. <coughs> Alright, now let's close it out. Spirit, what's the message? What's the message? Go for it. 
So your prayers and positive expectations have been heard and answered. We've been working with you on the situation since its genesis, and we continue to watch over you and everyone involved. Stay on your current path as it would take you very far indeed. Mediumship. That could also be why this person looks like they can't control this. You see how she just looked like and spirit is coming through her. It could be this. Some of y'all are powerful light workers. Okay? And it's safe for you to be powerful. Your spiritual power brings great blessings and love and service into the divine. And then into the divine. Some of y'all with this medium shit may be sent to the light. I don't know. But some of y'all have the natural ability to connect with departed loved ones. Somebody is meant to be a star. If you look on this poise, that's like Hollywood star right there. So, I don't know. But this was the card that I was getting that it needed to stop, whatever it was. But y'all take it how it's going to resonate for y'all, okay? I love y'all from the bottom of my feet. You have two opportunities to forgive. Two cards of that has come out. Because somebody was doing some fucking. I love y'all from the bottom of my feet. Please do not make nothing fit. Take what resonate and leave the rest. Till next time.